morning from Bangkok, Thailand. We are here in Sukhumvit. We are on our last day officially here in Bangkok. We fly out tonight after dinner. Uh, right now, we're about to get some mango sticky rice from Mayberry. So let's go check that out. And we're about to get on the BTS. We've got a ticket for 250 baht, a uh, daily ticket. So let's get on the BTS. So we got on at a SOC station or BTS station and then we're getting off at Fong Lo and then directly opposite that is this mango sticky rice place. Meant to be pretty good so let's see what it's like. Oh 120 baht haircuts. Just at the train station here. And then over here, what have we got? No, oh, I thought they were condoms. <laughs> Those are eyelashes and makeup, vending machine for makeup, vending machine for something else, and some sort of food voucher vending machine. Oh, he's making the fresh jade for the temples. So this is the famous uh, place for the mango sticky rice. It is called Bay Marie. They've been here since 1987. So let's go in and uh, try one. Let it go. So what you get is the mango, the famous sticky rice, the condensed milk, and you also get some toasted um, Oh, that's the um, mung, mung beans. Mung beans, toasted mung beans. So we're gonna sit down and eat this and tell you what it's like. All right, so we're attempting to cross the road. This is a little bit uh, crazy, but we'll see how we go. And then we've got traffic on the other side. All right, let's attempt this. Thank you. All right, we did it. <laughs> so we're just inside the uh, coffee club to get a nice cold iced coffee and they're allowing us to eat the mango sticky rice here. So let's open this up. So we've got the beautiful fresh mango. We've got uh, multiple colored sticky rices. Um, we get the mung, dried, m toasted mung bean seeds and then obviously the, um, the condensed milk. So this is it. Try a little bit of the rice. Tell me what you think with the mango. It's meant to be the best in town. Oh, it's good. The mango is really good. The mangoes, yeah, meant to be one of the best. I don't know what's the best because I haven't tried every single store in the town, so I can't True, really she doesn't know what is the best because she hasn't tried every one, but um, so far so good. Mayberry mango sticky rice. What's that? Uh -huh. li lipstick? Did you kiss your own hand? shopping mall and what we have here is and it's actually set out so it's like an airport so each level is a different terminal and each level is designed based on a different country so level one is Tokyo level two is London 
Level three, I think, is Italy. Uh, level four is Paris. And yeah, it's all themed differently and decorated differently based on each country. So pretty cool shopping mall. Um, the Thais love to come here and shop. I think because they like to stay cool because it's so hot here in Bangkok. So that's why it's so busy. I mean, this is a uh, Friday. Uh, what are we? Friday, uh, 12.30 in the afternoon on a Friday. So imagine how busy it is on a weekend. So we're here at the Siam Paragon Mall and what you do is you get a little card and you do a little prepaid, you buy a little prepaid card and you can go to any one of these stores with the card and they swipe it and then they deduct the money off that you spend. So the one that I think Gina got was about 90 baht, which is this one, which is like a beef uh, boat noodle soup and the beef literally is just like glistening. Oh, well, there's my beeper. I've got to get my... My, uh... Can I leave this? Excuse me. Can I leave this here? I'll get my... Thank you. So Gina got a massive oyster omelette. How much was this one? Yes. 80 baht? 100 baht. 100 baht. Well, it's massive. You got the boat noodle soup, which is beef boat noodle, which is beautiful. Yeah, that uh, chili is really spicy. And I got the famous uh, pad thai. Probably thinking, that doesn't look like pad thai. But it's actually cooked in the modern way. So the pad thai is actually in here. You have a look. Yeah, it's because they use fresh tamarind juice. That's why it's that orange color. So we'll open it up and uh, we'll have a taste. So this is the omelette. I'm gonna try the oyster omelette. Let's try this. A lot of chili, I gave you. Oh. oh. It's really eggy, soft and gushy, but also really crispy on the bottom. And you get that hint of those mussels, the flavor of the mussels, and then all that chili that Gina put on. Oh god, it's spicy. And this pad thai is probably literally amazing. I can imagine how good it tastes in the real store. Dim Sum I has got another proper store near J5, um, which is a famous food stand. But yeah, this is some seriously good pad thai. That tamarind taste is amazing. <laughs> If you want to find this food court, it's located at the ground floor of the CM Paragon and all the food is actually pretty cheap. I saw some stuff for like 80 baht, 60 baht, all the way up to 150 baht. So yeah, really good value and it's air conditioned so you can't go wrong. Got all that juicy beef there, absolutely succulent. I'm sure it's been cooking for about two days. You got that sweet, beautiful uh, aromatic broth. You can taste the uh, the cinnamon and the star anise and all the Chinese herbs and spices. Absolutely beautiful. And Gina's quiet when she's eating. You know it's good. <laughs> Gina's here shopping at the Saint Laurent store. I think she's going to get a purse, a travel purse. So she's just having a look at everything. So she picked the travel pouch, travel wallet for her phone and passport here. Beautiful E Saint Laurent or YSL. And uh, she's just filling out the iPad information because when we leave the country, we can get back the GST or the tax. The fancy tea store, TWGT. Really, really fancy. That's their tea here, and they've, they've got a cafe. They got some beautiful, real orchids. These are amazing. Look at that. It's probably grows like a weed here. And all the orchids all the way along. You know, all the beautiful teas.
shopping we uh after lunch we bought some clothes i bought um a couple of t-shirts and um some things that you can buy here that you can't get in australia uh so a jumper like a jumper for winter uh things like that so yeah just did some shopping gina bought her purse from ysl and i'm just heading back to the hotel so we're gonna freshen up have a shower and uh head off to dinner <laughs> 